What's going on, guys? Nyla Simone here with a very special guest in the building. I've been hearing about this guy all over town, left and right, accolades from Gabe to Noodles. We got Shot EK in the building. How are God, you? God. I'm, good. I'm chilling. Chilling? Fact. How you feeling? You came up here blinged out, iced out? Blingy. <laughs> I see you. Thanks. How are you? Chilling. I'm ready to work. Yeah? Right. You've been doing it. You've been dropping weekly? Yeah, every week. How how is that? Did you plan that over the pandemic? Like just got mashed in the can and was just like I'm a release, or is this like as like, you go? Like I was just going and and I was just dropping every day after a while. Okay, so let's I guess bring it back and start with um, the drill sound in general and the Bronx drill sound and how it got hot for those who aren't like aware. It all started in the house, gangster, on my block. Everybody went there their first track. Everybody that's rapping now from the Bronx. It all started in the house. We just rapping. And it, it really started going crazy. Mm. So it all started in the house. Who did it start with, though? My son. It started with my son, Ainge. That's his crib. Ainge from 10. So, like, we was in it. Like, he was engineering Booba. Okay. And from there, it started with Booba. And Booba Wait, made that Booba song. was the first Bronx yeah. drill rapper? He was, like, the first one to, like, Show Track. everybody like he was rapping. It was in Bronze Drill, yeah. But like, he the first one to come out that crib. So then that's when we all start going in. Okay. I start going in. I brought everybody there after a while, and it just started going crazy. But you guys weren't always doing the drill sound, right? You guys. No, nah, yeah, we was doing. A bit out. We was doing auto tune at first. Okay. But we were still listening to like Brooklyn Drill. Right, right, right. Then when it then we just started doing drill, then the Bronze just took, took over. Took over. Got it in a headlock. Okay. Nah, I see that. So, um, how long have you been rapping, and what like inspired you to start? Like two years, and just every because I, everybody I was around started like making it. I knew Lil TJ, mm. Smokey Mongella. That just showed me. I know I could I do can it. Do this, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Um, who would you say are your influences with your sound? Like, I don't really know. Nobody sound like me. <laughs> Thanks. Sir. Nobody sound like me. I feel that. Well, who are people you listen to, I guess, to find inspiration? Anybody? No. Nah. It's all you? Facts. Yo, you capping right now. Why are you Gangsta. doing that? I, I listen to other rappers, but I don't really sound like nobody. You are your own inspiration? You want some Kanye? What's your sign right now? I'm an Aries. Aries? You want some Kanye shit right now? He's like, yeah, who? What's my inspo? Me, duh. <laughs> nah, that ass. All right, I feel it. Um, So let's talk about... Um, you're doing all these drops. Are we gonna get a project from you this year? Yeah. Yeah. You got a name for it already? No. Uh -huh. But all the songs are done. Nah, I'm working on it. So it's you... fast. I, I record fast. Well, what's your recording process like? I just freestyle everything. Really? It's facts. Wait. So you mean to tell me once a week you just get up freestyle, put the freestyle out, and that's how it's been going? That's yeah. your process. Damn, okay, so when did it first like catch and get hot? Like when I when I drop like people say when I drop D and D, but I've been hot before that. Okay. But when I really noticed it was when I dropped Force FK. And I've been had that like I did it and I ain't dropped in like three weeks. But then I when I when I came back to dropping music, it went crazy. So it started picking up with D and D. The music video. Did you always have like the support of your your block? Yeah, facts. Yeah, and with that, did it did like obviously I know you got you know lost friends and stuff like that. Has it affected you in any way? It just motivated me mm. and go up. Yeah, keep going up. I respect that. Okay, so let's talk about um yo you're doing crazy numbers on YouTube. How did you like? How did you feel getting that type of feedback? I can't believe it. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> that shit crazy. Yeah. Cause everybody be down with me, so it's like, once I start going crazy, I knew it. Yeah. Like, how does it feel being the underdog? Good, cause now everybody doubling back. Mm. Have you had a Have you had a moment where you had to make people eat their words yet? Nah. Not yet. They just seeing. I know they watching. Are you gonna do it though? Hell yeah. Yeah. How you plan on doing it? I don't know. I just go how it's going. <laughs> okay. I get that. 
Um, all right, so we get new music weekly. We got a project coming. When is the project coming? A couple months, like two months. Okay, we 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 getting any offers? You got to be having crazy deal offers. I got signed. You got signed? Who you get signed to? Somebody. Somebody? Why are you doing that? You coming you up here that. with this? <laughs> you got me with that bling. <laughs> oh, that's why you get came in with the bling. Congrats, big right. congrats to you. Thank you. Um. So you're not gonna tell me the label, no. Heavy, it's heavy. It's heavy. If I guess, will, will you tell me if I'm right? <laughs> yeah. No. Uh, I don't know. Columbia. Heavy. Atlantic. No, you really gonna do that to me? All right, fine. So, with these uh coming up features, who you got? Uh, who you collabing with? I don't know. Whoever want to work with me, whoever fuck with me, I'm ready to work. You ready to work? Are you um going to like expand outside of the drum sound and get into other genres? Yeah. What sound are you looking to get into? Like auto tune. I, I do my auto tune, but right now I'm not stopping. They're gonna hit a drill for a long time. Okay, I get that. And with the auto tune, you singing? Facts. Yeah. Can you sing without auto tune? A little bit. A little bit. All right, cool. Any producers you want to shout out that you work with or any producers you're trying to work with? Like, I work with, like, somebody from Chicago. He be sending me beats. His name Chi. He different. Mm. My son sent me all my best music, best beats. And Ziggy on the keyboard. Fire. What, are, anybody in the city? No. Nah. Not yet. You need to do with some city collapse, though. Come on, you got to show love to the city. I would like to see you with some Chicago artists. Have you tapped in there yet? No. Any, they know me though. Yeah, anybody in Chicago hit you up trying to work? Nah, only person I text was Young Chop. Okay, that's dope. My son different. Y'all, y'all friends? Y'all getting in the lab? Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna well, do something. Well, I'm looking forward to seeing everything you got coming out. Uh, I'm ready for you to tell me who you got signed to, but I'm not gonna push it. Come on. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> All right, fine. Um, let everybody know your gram where they can follow you. Shy K, Shy everything K, blue check coming. You know the vibe. You gonna get me on YouTube, Shy K, Shy K everywhere. Okay. Right. He said the blue check is coming. You know, <laughs> niggas can't call me no more on Instagram. <laughs> Yo, why you already acting Hollywood like that? Okay, I'm crazy like I ain't gonna lie. Hey, gonna... I respect it. The work is there, the music is there, and I'm rooting for you. All right, until next time, guys. Peace.